the boat blast in Fort Lauderdale. There was a pretty big explosion on a 28-foot vessel that was docked, and there were people on board. The victims, they were taken to Broward Health Medical Center. That's where Local 10 News reporter Snella Sabovic has an update for us tonight. Snella. Well, what a scary ordeal for a group of people enjoying their Sunday afternoon out on the water. They were backing this vessel into a fuel dock at Lauderdale Marina, when all of a sudden, without any warning, it just exploded. Thankfully, a nearby firefighter was around. He rushed into action. I heard a loud boom, loud thud. A 28-foot boat docked at Lauderdale Marina exploded this afternoon with six people on board. Take a look at all the damage left behind on the vessel. It literally blew the, the back end of that boat apart. We're told the boat was backing into a fuel dock at the time of the explosion. It was a flash, it was a flash explosion. The flames were hot instantaneously, and then they went out. It could have been much worse if this thing would have caught fire. William Garland, a retired firefighter, saw the whole thing unfold. He quickly jumped into action to help the victims, who he says included a woman, a man, and a young boy. He fractured her left leg, and then her son is about five years old, and he had just singed burns on him because the explosion blew, it, blew the fire out. Thank God for that. So uh, all we did was tend to, tend to the injury. We've also learned that a fourth person was also transported to Broward Health Medical Center. So three of those victims, including that little boy, were brought here to Broward Health Medical Center. They sustained minor injuries. A fourth person also here sustained serious but non-life-threatening injuries. The cause of that explosion still remains under investigation this evening. That's the latest here from Fort Lauderdale. Sonella Sabovic, Local 10 News.